Welcome back. We are here looking at the foreign exchange market and this is going to be my daily forecast for Friday, uh, November 13, 2020. If you like to have uh, if you like to support our channel, you're welcome to subscribe by clicking this bell uh, this button down in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. Uh, we also have a signal service over at Patreon. We have over over 60 traders uh, using that signal service already. And you'll also get access to our full technical analysis by joining us at Patreon. You can find the link below uh, in this video. So we'll start by looking at the uh, Great British Pound and the US dollar. And as expected, we have broken down quite significantly in this market. We ran into major resistant here at 13 uh, for uh, 40, uh, 32 and now we're heading towards the uh, 50 moving average right here at 1296 if that breaks then we'll go all the way down to the uh, 150 moving average moving average at 1283 so i don't expect us to go all down here i think that will go towards the 50 moving average and then bounce from that Technical indicators for this market are looking very negative at this point. So we are going lower. We are going to see um, something similar to this towards the 50 moving average and then probably bounce from there. If it breaks, it will go towards the 150 and that will be, certainly be major support in this market. So if you look at the US dollar and the yen, this is a market that I have entered. I entered right up here because I think that we are going to go and continue in this channel, which we have been in for several months, all the way back to April. So what we are looking for here is probably a few days where we travel a trade above the 50 moving average. Uh, we'll test this trend line several times and then break down. So we'll see something similar to this or we'll see some choppiness all the way down very gradually towards this downside. So probably a little bit more. Uh, it will take some time. It is a, it is a currency pair that takes quite a lot of time when, when it moves, but it can do these explosive moves to the upside. But the target is these lows here uh, where we'll find this trend line also will connect to. That is basically the idea. Um, at this point, we are star starting to turn around, but we are looking for the MACD to do the same. Stochastic has turned around. Uh, the RSI is also starting to turn, turn around. So the CCI has turned around and also the Bollinger Band. We are basically at the top of the Bollinger Band. So this is a very promising trade for a sell to the downside. US do Euro US dollar. We have rallied from the 50 moving average, and at this point, the 50 moving average is quite supportive. And we also know that the highs here at 11.92 are also very resistant. So it's probably that that we could rally towards these highs. If we break the 50 moving average, then we are going significantly lower. We're going all the way down to 11.64, and this is not a market that's very interesting. We are basically in the middle of this range and I never like trading in the middle of ranges because it's just much, uh, it's too risky. You can break either way and therefore it's mainly a 50-50 chance that you get this trade correct if you enter this market right now. So Aussie US dollar, this is also a trade that we uh, over at Patreon also have have signaled that you can basically start to sell at this point. And our target is first the 50 moving average, which is around here, 0, uh, 71, 54. It may vary. We could also see this market go all the way down to the 150 moving average, which would be the better trade. But we are turning around. This is a market that is going to lower. We will most likely go to this area here and if we bounce from there then of course it's a signal that we should enter the, leave the market again and that is also a signal that we'll go back to the upside but a break below the 50 opens the door to these lows of 0 0.70 uh, 79 and if you look at the technical indicators they are all indicating that we are going to go significantly lower with Aussie US dollar so if you look at the US Canadian dollar 
it is doing what we expected it to do. It is rallying up towards the 20 exponential moving average at this moment and will most likely go all the way to the 100 moving average. So the 100 moving average is right here as 1.32. And when we get there, we will most likely break to the downside. So the lows at this point are here. But at some point, I do believe that we are going to break these very lows and go all the way back towards this channel, which we were in for a very long time. That is the expectation uh, for this uh, for this market, but we'll see. At this point, we know that the 100 moving average is very, very re resistant, and so is the 150 moving average. So no interest in basically buying this, it's basically selling every rally in this market because we're technically in a downtrend. So, hope you find this helpful. You're welcome to support our channel by clicking the subscribe button down in the corner. Hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos. And if you like our full technical analysis, you are welcome to join us over at Patreon. You'll basically join um, a group of over 60 traders as well. So, good luck and thank you very much. Thank you.